Hello, we are the Legals, and today we are going to be discussing Landon Norris's new contract that he's got with McLaren. He's staying there till 2025, so that'll be four seasons worth. So I'm guessing with them committing Lando for that long, they've got some big ambitions. What are we thinking? I think they're just using it to lock him in, to be honest. I think they're just yeah. finding a way to, to secure him, because he's a good driver. We know that. I mean, we're the Lando fans. Yeah. Um, yeah, I think, he's a driver of big potential, isn't he? But he's one of those people I can't really, I don't really know where he's going to go next. I think if there was anywhere to go, I'd say Mercedes personally, because like McLaren and linked with Mercedes. So you'd think, think that would be the next step? I think Hamilton's got another two years left in left. Yeah, I reckon two no, years. No, I believe, left. well, I believe his contract ends this season. So every extends for another year. Depends how committed he wants to be. I mean, it's taken him a long while to pretty much confirm that he's carrying on this I can't season. see Lando taking over from him. I no. can't see that being a move, no. Why is that? I don't know. Don't forget, like, this, this could potentially be a year to two years, maybe even three. Mm. So, by then, Lando's going to be a more of an experienced driver. He's been, he's been on the track for a while now, and he's been proven that he can get up to the top of the field. True. Get on the podium. He nearly had that race win. I know a nearly race win isn't really much like you can I love that. Claim. He nearly, he yeah. nearly did this. He, he nearly did but, that. I mean, he's had, he's been a pulse hitter. He's been on the front row. He's been second row on the grid. Look, he won't. The point is, he won't need to move because he's going to be in a championship winning car. Why would he I need think, to move? So it makes me wonder: Is our McLaren go for it? I thought that last year, but. They seem to drop away. Yeah. Which was really, unless they are just forgetting about it and going, nah, they'll be focused on next year. But how many times can you say let's focus on next year? Well, exactly. You got, as much as you want to focus on next year, you have to focus on now. Like, what are you going to do now this season? Mm. But I I think locking them in for that long, I think they've got big ambitions and I think they will be wanting to go for championships. They must feel confident that they've got a car that can contend with the cars at the top, your Mercedes, your Red Bulls. I hope so. And Ferrari as well. Ferrari will be I really there, I believe. So. I, want them, I want them in the, in the mix. I want to see Ricardo yeah. as well do well. He's a good I driver. I really want to see Ricardo do well because, yeah, fantastic driver and he deserves a lot more uh, credit than what he gets. Yeah, to see him win a, I don't know, to win a few races or even challenge for it would be so cool. Yeah. Like, he... I don't know. It's one of those not drivers. Get a championship. I love friends get a championship. I feel like yeah, to rub it in Verstappen's face. <laughs> you can't, what can he rub into his face? He's already got a championship. Yeah, but loosely. <laughs> let's be honest. Yeah, well, you got it. You got it in your. Yeah, he can't be taken like, away. Can't really take it from him. So. Which doesn't seem right, but. I mean, that is only twenty-two, five years, takes him up to. 27, that's still young in the, in the Formula 1 yeah. career. So he's still got a long road ahead. And I reckon he will get a title with him. Hopefully in that McLaren. Don't know about Hopefully. this year. But That'd be good. That'd be so good. Next couple of years, keep an eye. Ferrari as well, could be an up coming one. Yeah, I think Ferrari will be a, a contending car. I, I really do think they... I think Carl Sainz will be a world champ as well, personally. I don't think Leclerc's got it. I don't think he has. I, I know there's fans out there, but... He has shown moments of being a quality driver, but Sainz having a bit more experience, and he he, he outshone Leclerc last year. So, yeah. he's. I just feel like he'll be the one, if any Ferrari driver gets the championship, it'll be him. He's the one that, yeah, I agree. It'd be good to see him stay with McLaren. Yeah. Because there's like always that worry. Boy for McLaren, isn't he? Yeah. Right yeah. minute, anyway. Yeah, um, you you never know how they're going to go sometimes. Like, you look at Aston Martin getting better, and it's just like, you know, why a bit of a weird move, really. But yeah, you can sort of understand it. But you hope that they would keep hold of the younger drivers and give them a chance. I did hear that Lando had conversations with competitive teams about moving. But whether he was just using that as leverage to get a better deal at McLaren, I don't know. I can't see where he would have gone. Well, there was room on Mercedes and Red Bull were talking to him. 
Uh, he's not. But he's not established it enough. Seem right. He's not established enough. No, yeah, I get that. But, I mean, Red Bull do like to go for a younger driver, don't they? They do. So maybe you know <laughs> he would never go back to, to like a Alpha Tauri, would he? No. So no, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think Red Bull will ever take him on. And I don't know about Mercedes. Red Bull weren't sure if. Then again, back, I think they would have known. Then again, um, we had Red Bull bringing in Perez, who had never been in Red Bull before. Yeah. Very yeah, true. he didn't go through the school system, so. And he only got that because of that last that that race when he got. Yeah. Um, Bahrain or Sakhir, mm-hmm. Sakhir, whatever it was, I can't remember. Was so Bahrain, a, there's a good few. Uh, a few deals coming up, I think, for drivers, and I think McLaren wants to lock Norris in. Yeah, I mean, it's the, the to, best to give a four-year deal is pretty huge. Yeah, absolutely, and I, I think they will go for it. One, one season within them four years, they will go for it, and I think they will be a true contender. And hopefully, Norris has the bottle to go for it. He needs that. He needs that push. Yeah. He needs to be a bit more ballsy. Because he'll he'll get some get that, yeah get that confidence up yeah so I think that's a good place to stop and uh, I think that's all we can discuss in the matter but it's a good move by McLaren it's good very good there's high hopes for him in the future yeah cool and from two McLaren fans that's the best thing you could possibly hear <laughs> so maybe we can enjoy some some, some, some in the good racing with him now yeah like it'll come I want it'll fair come. racing yeah but I don't really care about the two front runners I want the back ones to catch up with it, give them a race. Yeah, yeah exactly. Make make this the, the most competitive season ever. I hope so. I really do. I hope a lot of others are caught up and just said, right, this is our season now. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Cool. But yeah, I think Ricardo will have it over, over Norris. Yeah. 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 I mean, at the moment, at the so moment, experienced in any short term, period. short term. Yeah. We shall leave it there. That has been it from us, and we will see you in the next one. Goodbye.